Hi to my Anna. She's not being very cooperative. She doesn't like the camera. Say hello. It's so precious. My sweet baby. How are you today? Good. Thank you for asking. More beauteous things to share with you. I think this is one you've already seen. I ordered a second set because I just wanted to have more than one. And I think these are the second set. I'm going to show you again anyway. In case you missed that video. I'm bring you closer to me. So I didn't have to stretch so far. Readjust. Okay. So these are another set of ornaments, and they are the thicker acrylic ones. I call them ornaments. You can use them for whatever you like, but I put them on my tree. So we have Mr. Ho-Ho Claws. We have a tree. We have a cute stocking with a little reindeer dude in there. Isn't he cute? I love him. We have a cute little snowman. This is the main reason I got this set, because look how stinking cute he is. Love him. Love him. And then we have Santa's bag of gifts. Cute, right? I like them. So these come with the standard ball chain and clasp. I just use the ball chain part. I've got a, I'm collecting a bunch of those clasps. I should start making keychains with my... Etsy stuff, my resin stuff. What is going on here? So first off, we have some AB crystal. We have adorable little snowflakes. Look at them. They're so cute. They're like little pearl snowflakes. And then this is more of the crystal AB. Just a tad smaller. There's red, yellow, and kind of that chartreuse green. And yellow, blue, and orange. Then we have white. AB drills. I had to see if they were drills or pearls. And then we're getting into the little bit um, different stones with that weird chartreuse again. And then here is kind of a grayish white AB drill. It's a very pale gray. I don't know if you'll be able to tell. Yeah, there you go. So we have gray and white. Then there are brown. Two shades of brown. Red and is that black? Yes, that is the black. Those are the colors for the little ornaments. Keychains, bag chains, gift tags. You can these are not double-sided, so you can write to and from if you write really small for him. This will be a perfect one to and from. You can use those for little um, gift tags, which I think is a great idea because then your recipient can add it to their tree and always put the date on them if you give someone an ornament. Always put the date on it if you can. There are my little ornament friends. So cute. The Santa Claus is funny. I'm not a huge Santa Claus fan, but he is pretty darn cute. He's pretty cute. He's not creepy. A lot of Santa Clauses are creepy, but he's not bad. All right, so let's see. Let's do a canvas next. This one I'm very excited about. We have the regular toolkit. So I found out they call these bubbles paintings because they are full drill, but they have a lot of different size stones on the background. And this is not one of those paintings that you can use your multi-placers with because if you look closely, 
there are very few straight lines. So this will definitely take a little bit longer than most paintings, but it is gonna be so worth it because wait until you see the drills that come with these. I love that there's gonna be teardrops on his body for like the little feather accents. I can't wait to see what the berries are and the tree and the colors in the background. I'm excited, very excited. I like that it, it shows yellow, blue, and pink. So I'm very curious to see what the actual colors are going to be on the background. I'm thinking they're just white or, or clear because the original artwork does not show a color on the background. It's over here so it doesn't end up in the floor. Yeah, they're just clear. Bummer. There are the clear ones for the background. And as you can see, there are four, five. No, I take that back. There's one bag that's this size two bags that are this size, and then I'm looking at it upside down too, so that's why I was confused. And then there's three bags that are this size. So these are all just regular clear rhinestones, and that will be the background of our cardinal. Oh my gosh, these are for the tree. <gasps> Look at those. So pretty. So those will be the, um, I thought they would be berries, but I guess there's actually flowers on the tree. And then look at those beautiful teardrops we have. I love these. I call these mermaid scales. And then the pink AB. There are some more fuchsia colored. It's more fuchsia, not really. And then blue pearl and purple AB. And I think the rest are regular rhinestone size. We have green. Two shades of red. We have some AB crystal. That makes me happy. And that chartreuse again. Brown and regular black. So I'm sure I will have some leftover black drills. If you saw the video the other day. That huge bag of black rhinestones. But I really don't know if they look all that different. I'm gonna have to do like a side-by-side -side comparison on a painting and see if those black rhinestones, you can't go under there, baby. You don't need to go under there. You see her? She always wants to go under stuff. Why don't you sit by me? Hmm? You don't wanna be on camera? I hate to break it to you, but you are right now. You want to say hi to everybody? No? Okay. This is so cute. So cute. Standard toolkit. This is a regular drill. But, no it's not. They are squares. What is the matter with you? Find somewhere and park it, sister. He's Roman. Look at him! <laughs> Look at his little face! So, if you are not a Grogu fan, they have a new toy this year. He is snacking. So he has his weird little frog guy, and he has his sippy sippy soup, and I think there's a cookie. What else was there? Oh my gosh, it is the cutest thing. I want one so bad. $70, $80. So, yeah. I cannot, I cannot buy that for myself. So I'm kind of hoping one of my family members loves me enough to get that for me, but I doubt it. Isn't he cute though? I love this painting. He's so stinking adorable. He is just so cute. Look at his little feet. He's got little faces. I love this. And I'm really excited about the colors because the, I don't know, can you tell? It's more purple than blue. So I really hope the drills, well, actually I showed you, those are purple. So that I'm guessing is the background because there's two bags of those. 
So I'm happy that it's purple and not blue. His little face. He's just so cute. When I first got this package in the mail and opened it, I was like, oh my gosh. Because <laughs> I took them all out of the... I have to, you know, do my like little inventory sheet. But I didn't look real close. But that one, I looked really close. Good. So excited. So this is a 40 by 40. And there are 24 colors. The DMC are on the canvas. This seems to be the new norm, which I am very happy about. It definitely makes things a lot easier. What do you want? She's just sitting in the floor glaring at me. She doesn't like when I film. I don't know why. I don't know why it bothers her. I guess because I'm talking and the plastic crinkling. What is it with cats and plastic? They will play with plastic. Like she tries, she, I'm surprised she hasn't tried to get in here yet. Because normally she will try to like climb in the bags. But if I'm crinkling the plastic or somebody else is crinkling the plastic, it's like, it's going to kill her. Cats are weird. Every cat I've ever had is like that. They'll play, it's got to be their terms. I guess that's just it. Cats are just goofy. All right, let's just jump right in. We got a separate bag here, or a separate row. So we'll start with these. We have very beautiful baby blue and then two shades of off-white. Actually, this is blue. This is 37.56. So this is a blue, but it's more white. It's just got the slightest tint of blue to it. Here we have beautiful pale peach. Those two colors are so much fun together. Lavender and kind of a coral color. Oh, she heard me say it, so now she's going to the bag. Look at that orange. Can you hear her? She's actually climbing in the bag now. You little monkey. You heard me talking about it, didn't you? You are silly girl. <laughs> she started to go in and then came back out. These two colors are really pretty together, too. Look at that. This is a peach, pale peach color, and then lavender, and this beautiful, beautiful reddish coral color. Those are gorgeous. I'm guessing that will go on his outfit. Turn this around this way. Beautiful, like a cranberry color, pale pink, and a brownish orange. Look at that green. I love that green. That's so pretty. Two bags of gray. So I guess my background is going to be purple and gray, which is kind of cool. And we have two teal colors and another peach. Kind of a sage green, brown, and a grayish or steel blue kind of color. Love, 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 love. My little Grogu boy's face and the pink. Bubblegum pink is beautiful with these two colors. So pretty. Even Well, all three of those, either one of these would be really pretty with that pink. And then there are the two bags of purple for the background. Lavender. Then we have very pale brown, dark brown, and a mauve. There are colors for that. That seems like so many more colors than 24. Yeah, you agree? <laughs> yeah, she says. Well, she's mad because my door is closed. She doesn't like it when my door is closed. Let me get these put away and I have one more thing to show you today. Yes. Mama's done. Cool your jets. Whew. Whew. That was rough. All right. So next thing is the ball. It's in the ball. I like that they do that. It's extra protection. They don't have to put those in there, but they never have the ends closed. It's always just in there and then flattened. So for packaging or for shipping purposes. And then this actually I can reuse because it hasn't been sealed yet. 
always, always reuse when you can. Sorry, my nose is just. Ugh. So here we have our toolkit with a chain. Ooh, aren't they cute? I am like so obsessed with them. You should see how many gnome crochet patterns that I have that I have to be working on all year long. I was hoping to get more of them made as gifts this year, but of course, I'm running out of time because I put too many things on my plate. But aren't they cute? I love them. Super cute. So the holes are up here on these two hats. Excuse you. Shh. The holes are up here on their two hats so that they it will hang um, centered. And we'll quickly look at the stones. But actually, you can see this is actually right on. So you have red, green, blue, clear. Oh, wait, I don't see whatever number eight is. I don't see the special. Should be a marquee. Oh, there they are. Oh, okay. I guess I'm showing you anyway. Blue, green, and clear. Red, orange, and amber. And then yellow, and then here are the marquee. They're kind of that champagne-y kind of amber color. Trying to get it without the glare on it. So that is what will go on these guys. So they're mainly regular rhinestones with just the marquee thing on there. That's super cute. Those are really fun. All right, so that's it for today. I will see you again very soon. Thank you so much for being here. I really appreciate it. And I hope you have had a great week and will have a great week next week or whenever you're watching this. Have a great one. I will see you again very soon.